series of deadly shootings in Mississippi. Six people were killed and one person injured in a small rural town near the Tennessee border. The suspect is in custody facing first degree murder charges and the sheriff says more charges are expected. CBS's Omar Villafranca has the new details. Police said the shootings began around 11 a.m. in the community of Arkabutla when one man was shot dead outside a store and then a woman was gunned down in her home. According to sheriff's deputies, the suspect, identified as 52-year-old Richard Dale Crum, fled, but they soon spotted him in a car. After a brief chase, police say Crum was taken into custody. By the time it was all over, police said four more people were found dead two inside a home, and two more outside near the suspect's house. I look out the window and I see... Ethan Cash said he came outside, saw the attacker carrying a long gun, then found one of the victims inside a truck. I go up to the truck where a guy got shot at, and uh, I'm just, I check his pulse and everything, make sure he's okay. He's, he's already gone at this point. Tonight, the rampage has shaken this town of nearly 300 people. It is such a tragedy, and we never would have thought anything like that would have happened here. The local elementary school was on lockdown during the incident. Mississippi's governor says the gunman acted alone, but his motive remains a mystery. Margaret? Omar, thank you.